Well, hello there, everybody. Dre here, and welcome back to another episode of Construction Simulator. Today, we're going to get back out and uh, hopefully earn a lot of money because I'm kind of poor in this game now. If you missed the last episode, we played multiplayer for the first time. Well, that was magical. But yeah, we played multiplayer for the first time, and I quickly realized my friends are jerks, and I fired them because uh, they spent all my money. So today, we have to actually earn some money because uh, I don't have actually too much in the old bank right now. But we'll definitely do some more multiplayer later on. What I'm actually excited about right now, though, is I want to start working on one of the campaigns. These are where some of the most complex and interesting jobs are. And I think we're going to continue with tourism, just because that sounds like it's going to be a lot of different things, whereas urban space will be a lot of building. And yeah, I don't want to just build buildings, and I feel like tourism gives me the best chance to do a bunch of different things. Plus, I did notice that there's a bridge here. And I kind of want to see how we're going to build a bridge in this game. So first of all, we got to do the boardwalk. So yeah, we're going to do this job. I don't know if we'll get it all done today. Um, oh, and well, as I said, I was poor. Uh, do I still want to accept the job? Yes, because I can get a loan. And we should probably do that. Well, let's just wait. I'd rather not get a loan unless I absolutely need to. Um, and we do earn money as we go about these jobs. So we might have enough to do this. All right, but here we are. Looks like this is where we're going to be putting the boardwalk in. Rather big area here. Let's talk to the tourism officer. Hello. Hi, I'm happy to see a new face in the industry. I was hired to establish beach tourism for the city as a secure source of revenue and to draw upscale beach visitors and vacationers Why are you wearing here. sunglasses at night? It's a long-term investment and an opportunity to make this city more attractive to its many residents again. Together, we'll make a few changes to transform this bleak place into a beach paradise with recreational offers and vacation facilities. This beach used to be noted in every tourist guide for this country and has always been a popular meeting place for a stroll along the water. Now, the glamour of the okay, old days lady, has faded. Okay, lady, this is getting way too long. Sadly, I'm sorry, I'm barely... just going to skip this. I just want to build things. I don't care about the history of tourism here, honestly. Just pay me, because I need money. All right, well, first and foremost, uh, we get the flatten. Uh, this is definitely not flat. People said I should use my backhoe for this, but honestly, I don't think that's a good idea. Let's try it just to see. Oh my god, I'm gonna have to... I should probably buy a bulldozer for here, just because of how big this is. But... I just want to see if it works. I don't think it's working at all. I'm getting a 0% flattened area. Did, did I just grab dirt and that's it? Yep. Okay. I'm just literally moving dirt. I do need a bulldozer, I think, to, to even do this. So we're going to have to go rent one of those right now. All right. I think I'll spend the big boy money to get the big dozer as well, just because uh, this is a big area that we have to flatten. So... It's actually, I saved 10% today for some reason, so I'm I'm happy about that. All right, and here we go. We have the beast here, so we're just going to do uh, this. We've seen this before, so I probably won't show too much of it, but basically, we just want this whole area flattened. And hopefully now, yes, we are slowly doing that. Oh, yeah, this is just super pleasing. <laughs> Can I just do this all the time? All right, I think we might actually be able to finish up once we get this little mound down. Because it does seem to make the percentages go faster when you get rid of the larger mounds. I do have a small mound to the left, as you can see. I'm just going to try and get rid of this line that I made. Uh, I might actually be able to do it right here. It's going to be close. 98. Of course, 99. All right, just hit this hill here, and then we should be good. Get it. Please? Yay! All right, it's actually still not totally flat. Usually it updates to be totally flat, but that's cool. All right, but before we waste too much money, let's uh, return that. We can always re-rent it if we do need to, and I only spent five ninety six dollars because I did that so quickly. All right, so now we got to go get materials. Now, I did see that there's actually a really useful materials thing here, and it tells you where exactly the materials come from. It's looking like it's all from Building Material Dealer. Perfect. Okay, and the only building material dealer that I have unlocked is all the way at the northern spot where we spent the majority of the starting of our game. There might be ones we can unlock with these question marks. I probably should just explore those question marks one day. Um, I will do that very soon. I'm just going to fast travel this stuff over because we can. And I want to get as much done today as possible. I hope I have enough money. Oh, I got 162,000 now. Literally bulldozing gave me 100,000 credits. I love that about this game. You get paid as you do tasks. You don't have to do the whole job to get paid. All right, so I think that is everything. 
I'm going to deliver it directly to the construction site because that delivery cost is almost nothing. Um, and being that I'd have to go all the way across the uh, map. No, thank you. Okay, so we got everything here, I believe. Why are they... Wait, where's the... Wait, where are they? Oh, they're over here. So you couldn't place them where it wants me to place them. You had to place them just over here a little bit. I just realized, do I not have a crane drop off here? Oh, I don't have a large crane. So I'm going to have to use um my truck all right so we'll stack as much of this as we can bring it over 10 feet and then i'm assuming i gotta pick it up again like i don't understand that all right so now i need to deliver and spread gravel once i drop this off god i need a faster crane this is driving me nuts with how slow these hydraulics are um i don't know how i deliver and spread gravel. i'm assuming i gotta go to the plant to get gravel because it's not this stuff here. Okay, so I need an articulating dump truck for this, or I guess any dump truck would make sense, but we might want to get a fancy one just because I want to drive a fancy one. So I'm going to get this orange one. Uh, again, rent's cheap for some reason right now, so we may as well. I mean, I could even get this little guy. <laughs> but yeah, I'm definitely going to have to buy a dump truck soon. It only makes sense to own one. I feel like we'll be using those a lot. All right, definitely might have got too big of a dump truck, but hey, I'm cool with that. I didn't even notice that it had four wheels on the back. This thing is, is freaking great. Let's actually check the inside. Oh, it's in the middle. Dude, the cockpits in these are so exciting. All right, but we got to go to the gravel plant, obviously, to get gravel. So we're going to do that now. And it should be as easy as dumping this out. I don't know. Oh, yeah, there we go. Sliding in. <laughs> Look at that drifting. Oh, this thing is fun. I want this. All right, aim it up. That looks good. And extract me some gravel. I don't know how much I'm going to need. But again, we may as well just fill it up. When you when you sell this back from renting... Oh my god, you actually have to like aim this. Or it like, can possibly overfill, I think. All right, we'll just get a bit more for good luck. Dude, that's so cool that you have to like strategize where you're filling it. How much did I just spend? I hope not too much. Oh, I'm definitely slower now too. Okay, but that should be enough, I think. Worst case, we can always come back here and get more. I'm just... The more I turn, like, st stuff is coming out. I love the mud and dirt physics in this game, man. Okay, I made it. I didn't lose my whole load. Just, you know, like 30% of it. So, uh, that's a success in my books. Now, where the hell do I spread this? Everywhere? I'm assuming it's on the pathway. Oh, God. It's not hit my stuff. It wants me to go to the other side. I'm just looking. I'm thinking. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. It's doing it on its own. What? What? Way to freaking warn me. Wait, what is going on? Is that just spilling out and making little spots everywhere? All right. So it just says deliver and spread gravel in the marked area on the construction site. There's no marked area besides this pathway. So I got to assume that's what it means by marked area. Now, what do I do about the stuff that already leaked out everywhere? I don't even know. So I'm just going to slowly go down here and maybe open this thing up. No, I don't want to empty it. Oh, God. How do I open? Okay, so do I just lift it a bit? There we go. Okay, so you don't want to lift it too much, I don't think. I don't know what I'm doing. I don't know. The game's not really explaining much. Okay. But that seems to be doing stuff, so that's good. Yes. Oh, this is so fun. We have 5%, so I'm just going to kind of go back and forth. I don't want to waste my whole load right away so let's just do a slow pour obviously it's a little spotchy i don't even know if that's a word but don't worry we will come back and do some more it's a lot to manage here okay i'm just spreading gravel everywhere i really hope i don't have to clean that up regardless we're almost there 100 percent and oh my god i th i thought it would automate and look pretty i'm a little scared that it doesn't look pretty M mind you when we clear sometimes it updates Oh, I didn't even see the other pathways. Okay, well, it's compact time, so I'm assuming we're done with the dump truck. We're going to return that and get paid, hopefully, the majority of my gravel back. So 953 for the rental, and I should have give, been given some money. I hope I didn't lose that. I didn't see at the start. Like, why do you need five soil compactors? It's just, there's so many vehicles in this game. I don't know the difference of any of these. I'm just going to get the biggest looking one. Probably that one, I'm going to assume. 
All right, and it's compacting time. Let's get that thing down there. Dude, this feels so good. Uh, open up my menu, and compacting is on. There we go. I think we're doing okay. Do I have to worry about that? There's like some overflow there. I can't, I hate that I can't turn my head around, so I don't even know if I'm doing it right. I hope I am. All right, well, not much room for error on this one, as you can see. I did the majority of the areas here. Gonna finish up with hopefully this. Oh, I don't know if I'm gonna finish here. Oh, you jerk. Oh, just in time. Look at that. Oh, we got a player level. I don't know actually where we do our player level. We should probably figure that out. Profile would be it. Skills. There we go. Oh, oh my God. <laughs> I have five skill points. I've never spent one, and these will obviously help us a lot. All right, well, I've already complained about crane speed, so we're going to invest in that. Uh, we get plus 20%. There's, like, extremely specific things. Concrete viscosity. You are now skilled concrete worker and know how to mix the perfect concrete for smooth pouring without leaving any open spots. I don't even know what that means. All right, I'm going to get this as well so we earn more money because, uh, well, that would be nice. And buckets are quite small in this game, so we're going to invest in that. You know what? I'm going to put one more into crane speed. I haven't had capacity issues, um, being that the dump trucks are huge in this game. So let's get concrete viscosity, just because I don't know what the frig that means. All right, cool. So that stage is done. 117,000 in the bank. Oh, yeah, we need to unpack these. Okay, so do your thing, buddy. Unpack those. Oh. Well, that was... Well, that was easy. Let me guess, cement next? Oh, we're actually building a fountain. Oh, this is so cool. Okay, so yeah, we need concrete, lots of it. So once again, we're gonna have to rent a dump truck. All right, being that I don't have the fancy concrete spreader, I'm just gonna try and do a drive-by concrete drop here. It should work, because I can drive on top of this rebar. So we're gonna put pouring on and... Okay, it works, go! Go, my truck! Is this legal? I don't know if this is the way I'm supposed to do it, but this is the way I'm doing it. This is fun. Oh, and we have just emptied it. Oh, God. All right, so we got 75%, but 0% of the pour fountain. Oh, I just realized. So wait, we're pouring concrete in there? Or we have to be pouring water. What does that say? Oh, I think I'm forming a fountain. That makes sense now. So I need to pour it in here to build essentially a form? I think that's what I'm doing. If so, that's the freaking coolest thing. Anyways, I got to go get more freaking concrete now. All right, so this form should be pretty easy. If we go into the middle, it should spread all the way through. I'm assuming this is what I'm supposed to do. I really hope I don't screw this up. And we shall pour. And yes, okay. So I do got to actually move this thing around. I'm going to actually turn this off. And I'm just going to hit different areas of this. All right, so that should be good. Turn that off. Actually, I might be able to just spread this. How do I use this? Shoot on or off? Oh, I didn't know I could spread that out like that. So we'll move that over there. That should target that area. <laughs> I love this. I'm having so much fun. There's like no room for error here, but I think if we get this final corner, that should be the majority of it. And I'm just going to rotate the chute. There we go. Spread. 96. Oh my God. No, no, no. Oh, I screwed up. I screwed up. I'm still pouring out. I'm still pouring out. Whew. And please, please fill that stupid little hole. Done. Oh, no, no. Stop. Stop. Okay. It automatically turned off. <laughs> okay. We did that. Hopefully I have enough concrete left to finish this because I don't want to spend another 15k filling this thing. Oh, come on. 93. It's starting to trickle out. Oh, I freaking things in the way. Oh, no, 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 no. Go over here. Go over here quick. Oh, it's spreading so well. There we go. We freaking did it. Oh, 66,000. That, I didn't get paid enough. That was the hardest task yet, and I got paid the least. Okay, next up, we need some sand. So, we learned last time, don't want to overfill this, because then I'm just going to leak it out everywhere. That should be more or less good, I'm thinking. This is going to be such a cool park. I think we're getting soil next, so we're going to have, like, a little beach sandy area over here, another soil area. I don't know if we have to plant plants or anything. But yeah, I think just this area is going to be sand, so we shall do that now. And oh god, oh my 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 god. Okay, well, I got 39%. I guess I could do a big pile of it. I don't know if that's the right way to do it or not. What is going on? Oh, I didn't go all the way down, so it's making a weird noise. 
All right, and there we go. We're done. We're done. We're done. We put way too much sand in there. Oh, and look at that. Through the magic of editing, it's all filled in. Deliver and unload soil. What do I do with this sand? I think I can sell it back. I mean, there's a silo here. Do I sell it here? Or actually, before that, let's go down and see if there's any drop-off points over there. I'm assuming you drop it off where you get it. Oh, yeah, right here. Good thing I checked. So, do not want any more sand. You can have it back. Please pay me. <laughs> I hope I didn't waste money here. What the hell, man? It didn't even pay me. Am I supposed to leave the spot, maybe? Okay. I guess... Oh, there we go. Just took a while. So, I made 2,800 back. All right. Same idea as sand, except this time we have soil. Oh, my God. Close the back. Why is it coming out? Why is there an opening there? I don't know. Who cares? All right, and same as before, except soil. So we'll just slowly dump this out. And we should have more than enough here to finish this. Oh, God. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Okay, I let out way too much. All right, well, we did it. <laughs> so I guess it does automatically spread because I did essentially just do a mountain of it. But here we go. It's just going to magically do it for me. Perfect. Uh, What do I do now? Oh, I have to do build a boardwalk? Holy crap, this is a big job. But you know what? I'm not complaining. I have 350000 in the bank now. I'm earning some serious cash. Oh, I don't even know what I'm doing from here. But we got everything. I'm assuming we'll be building with that. That might be fully automated, though. We'll see in a second here. Uh, unpack construct materials. Okay. And just like that. Oh, we are done. Wow, that went... Really well, actually. I thought it would make me pour the concrete. I guess because I've done so much concrete, it was like, all right, you don't have to do it now. Does that mean this is going to automatically be done when we unpack this as well? Oh, okay. All right, so I need to actually place some of this stuff. I don't know what the hell I'm doing. I've never built a gazebo before. Uh, oh, I didn't even see this over here. Okay, so that makes sense. Can I just manhandle these? I feel like these are not that heavy. All right, so I guess I'm going to have to use the crane. All right, so we grab them by the ends. I parked a little close, but that's okay. As long as we can get this one in. Let's try this one first. Should be pretty easy. There we go. I'm getting pretty good with the crane. Oh, you really got to be on that. Okay, well, that's fine. We can put that there. So these other ones should be pretty easy. And drop it in. Perfect. Yep, as I assumed. We're kind of at a good spot, actually. So grab this. Raise it first, because we got to keep this long and away from me or I'm just going to hit my crane. And look at that. It's a UFO. Ooh. Well, we already did that, actually. So let's just drop this on. Oh, this is good. This is real good. That wasn't too bad at all. Done, baby. 75%. Now do we need... What, what do we need? Precast element concrete. Okay, so here's all the concrete stuff. Now, I think I can use, yes, my crane. The one purchase I've done so far in the game. Definitely worth it. We've used it pretty much every time. The crane area is blocked. Why? Because I'm standing on it? Oh, God damn it. Every time. Okay. There. God. Just tell me to move out of the way. Oh, we're doing like a border. Okay, this is definitely a good time to have the big crane. It did suggest that I could use a small crane, but screw that. We have this thing. We may as well utilize it. All right, well, I made quick work of that thanks to my super fancy crane. Got one more to do. And pick that up. Perfect. Just kind of scrape it over there just to save time. And done. Okay. Now I'm... Oh, I'm doing benches? Am I building a skate park? I'm trying to understand what this is. Okay, and the final one. And I think we got to do both sides because I'm seeing the same structure on the other side. Let me just crash this in here. I mean, it'd be nice if I wasn't swinging so much, but that's to be expected. Uh, okay. So I guess I didn't need to do the other side. It just made me do a little bit of it. Boardwalk stage. All right, so I'm realizing now I'm building an actual stage here. This is pretty cool. I need a large container for that. All right, so I think I got to go to this undiscovered location. I don't think I put this trail in here. So, uh, yeah, we're finally unlocking something new. And that's where we get the possibly large container. So some sort of new store where we can buy things. Oh, is this already here? I thought I could fast travel it to this to my uh, build site because I thought I'd have to buy it. Ooh, golden hammer. I guess I am going to actually need to bring a crane here and a big one at that. I don't even think this would fit uh, that thing on it. Can you walk the right? What the frig is going? Dude, what? What are you doing? What the? F what was that? I was trying to go that way the whole time. I swear that was so weird. Um, But yeah, I'm going to need a bigger crane. 
Not only am I going to need a crane, I'm going to need a multi-trailer. And can I use a truck with this? I'm assuming I need a transport truck, right? Yeah, let's just get a, tra a tractor trailer just in case. So I am renting a lot of junk right now. Um, so we got the crane. We're going to have to bring one at a time here. This is, this is a big job. All right, yeah, I'm assuming this should be more than enough space. Speaking of space, press that button. And yeah, this thing is massive. All right, but it's time to get out the big boy guns. Look at this thing. This is so cool. I want to see it from this view. All right, lower. I think we're pretty much on top of it. God, I, my, my depth perception is way off. Am I too far? Okay, I can see the thing up top. There we go. Connect. Uh, I feel like a freaking badass right now. All right, lower, lower. I think that's good. Nice and slow. I really wish you could rotate in this game because it feels kind of cheap when you can just slap it in a place like that. Okay, but that is it with this. I'm assuming we're going to need to take this to uh, the uh, job site, though, because we're going to need to get it off of this. Mind you, I might be able to use my big crane, so let's find out. All right, wide load coming through. Let's try not to hit anything. There we go. Yeah, we should be able to use my crane, I'm thinking. So we'll sell those things back so we're not wasting money on rent. Let's just make sure first, though. There we go. Yep, we can actually lift it with this little crane. Well, it's a big crane, but it's not a very big tower crane. I never saw myself up there. Actually, we can use this view. <gasps> oh, this is insane. I can't even look at where I'm trying to place this thing. All right, bring it in a bit. There we go. This is so much harder. There we go. Did it. Boardwalk stage is complete. And we just got to clear the construction site. We'll return this because I don't think we're going to be needing that now. Okay. And we just got to get myself out of here with my stupid little face. I think we're done. And I just got to run out. And then I think... Did we build it? Did we do it? Speak with the tourism officer. So I guess... Maybe that was part one. I thought we were actually building the stage right now, but it looks like this is just temp. Well, that was an anticlimactic ending, but we did a lot today, man. We uh, are really getting this place set up. What's up? This new look, the beach promenade is ready to be featured in any tourist brochure Hell again. yeah, dude. I hope that soon it will return to being the popular strolling area for tourists and residents that it used to be. I'll hire a photographer immediately since we now have to focus on promoting this city. Many thanks to you and your team. You mean just you me? really did a great I'm a, job here. I'm a one-man team. Okay, and it looks like, yes, through the power of time, we have built all of this. I kind of wish I was actually building all these little things, but honestly, that job would have taken forever if that's the case. So I do like that it kind of uh, speeds through these things, but that was fun. I really liked building the mold for the fountain. That was probably my favorite part. But yeah, we got all these special areas now. The soil area over here with the gazebo. Everybody's chilling here already. Oh, I feel good, man. That was that was a massive job. But hey, we earned well over $300,000 doing that. And that means we can actually probably buy some vehicles. I'm thinking we definitely want to get a dump truck soon. Uh, but yeah, we're going to wrap up this one here, guys. I'm excited for the next episode because I think we're going to be working on the bridge then. And uh, building a bridge just sounds absolutely fantastic. So yeah, I hope you guys are enjoying the journey that is Construction Simulator. As always, thanks for watching and liking, guys. I'll see you in the next one.